First, let's learn some basic structures. Click on the hotspots to reveal. The pathway of blood flow through the heart. Oxygen-poor blood from the body returns to the right atrium of the heart. Blood from the upper body returns through the superior vena cava. Blood from the lower body returns through the inferior vena cava. As the right atrium is filled with blood, it contracts. The tricuspid valve opens, and blood is pumped into the right ventricle. When the right ventricle is full, the tricuspid valve closes to prevent blood from flowing back into the atrium. The right ventricle contracts, the pulmonary valve opens, and blood is pumped into the pulmonary artery and to the lungs. The pulmonary valve closes to prevent blood from flowing back into the ventricle. Oxygen-rich blood from the lungs returns through the pulmonary veins to the left atrium of the heart. As the left atrium is filled with blood, it contracts. The mitral valve opens, and blood is pumped into the left ventricle. This occurs at the same time as the right atrium pumps blood into the right ventricle on the other side of the heart. As the left ventricle is full, the mitral valve closes. The left ventricle contracts, the aortic valve opens, and oxygen-rich blood is pumped into the aorta to reach all parts of the body. This happens at the same time as the right ventricle pumps blood into the pulmonary artery on the other side of the heart. The aortic valve quickly closes to prevent blood from flowing back to the heart. Meanwhile, the atria have filled with blood and the cycle repeats itself. Quiz time.